everybody, welcome to Unwrapped. I'm Mark Summers, and today we are unwrapping the secrets behind summer snacks. And nothing beats the heat like these frozen treats. We're gonna check out the folks at Blue Bunny Ice Cream, talk about how they combine strawberries and shortcake to make the perfect chili dessert. Mm. When you can't have a plate of mom's homemade strawberry shortcake, Blue Bunny has the next best thing. The king size strawberry shortcake bar. As you bite into it, you get the tangy, sweet strawberry taste, plus the creamy vanilla ice cream, and then it's completely surrounded with the shortcake pieces. This ice cream bar is the perfect solution when the mercury starts to rise. People really enjoy eating the strawberry shortcake bar in the summer because it's naturally refreshing with the strawberry and the vanilla ice cream. Check it out. Have you notice anything different about this ice cream bar? The king size strawberry shortcake bar. It's four and a quarter ounces. It's a large size. And you'll never guess how many of these extra large bars Blue Bunny makes every year. We make over six million bars every year. If you laid those bars from end to end, it would cover Mount Everest 700 times. That's a lot of shortcake. They make them at their factory in Lamars, Iowa. It starts on the production floor where the ice cream mixes are made. They make the mix in 300 gallon flavor tanks and then pump it into ice cream freezers. One for the vanilla and one for the strawberry. It's mixed with air in the freezer and then it's actually dispensed in a liquid form. It sounds simple, but how do they keep the strawberry and vanilla from mixing? keep the two different ice cream flavors from mixing together, they're dispensed at different temperatures and they use different nozzles. Vanilla is on the outside and strawberries on the inside, so it's kind of like an illusion. So when you bite into the product, you're like, oh wow, how did that strawberry get in there? With the strawberry surprise hiding inside, chilled brine runs underneath the molds and lowers the temperature of the ice cream. As the molds rotate around, they become partially frozen and now we're able to insert a stick into each one of the molds. Over 14,000 shortcake bars march through the stick machine every hour. Giant robotic arms pull the bars out of the molds and dunk them into warm brine, preparing them for their cookie crunch. But you'll never guess how they get it to stick. There's this uh, cool spiral auger that spins around real quickly and flings up the shortcake pieces so it covers it. Shortcake pieces fly through the air, covering every inch of the bar. It's really fun to watch. Now that they are wrapped in their colorful coat of crunchiness, they slide into wrappers and seal up tight. And then they are boxed, and they go into the deep freeze, which is minus 40 degrees. Very cold in there. But you can't buy these frozen bars at the grocery store. You'll only find them at convenience stores much more mobile than a plate of shortcake, dip of ice cream, and strawberries on it. And the best part is, no spoon required.